you've uh, written an interesting blog post if we take a step out of the realm of bits and into this, the realm of governance. You wrote a blog post about making Algorand governance decentralized. Uh, can you explain what that means, the philosophy behind that? You know, how, how do you <laughs> decentralize basically all aspects of this kind of system? Well, the philosophy and the how. Let's start with the philosophy. So I really believe that uh, nothing fixed lasts very long. And, uh, and so I really believe that life is about uh, intelligent adaptation. Things change and we have to be nimble and adjust to change. And, uh, and uh, when, I, when I see a lot of, uh, of a um, 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 crypto project, actually very proud to say it's fixed in stone, um, uh, right, you know, code is law, law is code, I verify the code will never change. And you go, wow. When I'm saying this is a recipe to me of, of disaster, not immediately, yeah. but soon. Just imagine you take an ocean liner and you want to go, I don't know, from uh, uh, Lisbon to uh, New York and you set a course, iceberg, no iceberg, uh, tempest, no tempest, and all. It doesn't matter. <laughs> you keep on going. That is not the way. You need uh, a till, you need to correct, you need to adjust. And, um, and so, um, um, by the way, we designed an algorithm with the idea that uh, the code was evolving mm -hmm. as the needs. And of course, a waiver is a system in which and every time there is an adjustment, you must have essentially a vote that uh, right now is uh, orchestrated with 90% of the stake. They say, okay, we are ready, we agree on the next version, and we pick up this version. So we are able to evolve without losing too many components left and right. But I think without evolving, any system essentially become asphytic and is going to shrivel and die sooner or later. Yeah. And, uh, and so that is, um, is needed. And what you want to do on the blockchain, you have a perfect platform in which you can log your wishes, your votes, your things, so that you have a guarantee that whatever vote you express is actually seen by everybody else. So everybody sees really the outcome, call it of a referendum, of a change, and that is, uh, in my opinion, uh, a system that wants to live long has to adapt.